Hi, Rachel. Hi, Candy. How do you like this entryway? This is magnificent. Look at these doors. I'm a very short person, but I feel really, really, really small. And look at the etched glass in the windows up there. That's Isn't this something? phenomenal. Look at these wood floors. And it goes both ways. Even look. into the what probably would have been the parlor at one time. And that staircase. Isn't that something? Scarlet could come down that stairway, yeah. couldn't she? Isn't that beautiful? All solid wood. I'm just wowed right now. Imagine the workmanship in something like yes. this. Let alone the material. But this carries throughout the house. It does, doesn't it? It's yeah. beautiful. Well, which direction do you want to go? We've got a dining room in here, and as I say, there's a parlor and another family room, a great room. Two connecting great rooms, actually. Okay, let's, let's go this way. Sure. All right. Okay, Rachel, look at this room. Talk about wow. space. Lots of space, lots of room here. Look beautiful at how, molding, isn't it? Beautiful molding. Look at how high the ceilings are. This look at is, that. Even the architectural details. Look at that little window area cut out. Yeah. Nice wow. big windows, and you'll see the newer windows too, which makes it uh, oh, that's great. A lot more economical mm -hmm. to heat a house like this. Look at these doors. Oh, look at these giant pocket doors. Aren't they something? With the knobs too. Yeah, the I've never knobs. seen pocket doors like this or yep. ceilings this high. I know, isn't it beautiful? And look at this room. Can you imagine just sitting here watching the snowfall all winter long? Or the sunshine in the summer, thankfully. Or today. Yes, today. <laughs> We've got a nice bright day. Look at those newer windows too, yep. you know? So that helps. And take a look at this fireplace. Isn't that beautiful? It's beautiful. The woodwork beautiful. in this house is just incredible. It's amazing, isn't it? And the handcrafted work around there, it's just, it makes it a focal point, doesn't it? Absolutely. And yeah. you'll see everywhere we go, these beautiful antique wooden floor. Now this little middle room is a family room. Um, you can see all pine, mm -hmm. nice bright window, great floors, yep. great room, great space, a little um, storage cupboard there. Cute. Now, how many people do you think we could fit in this room? Entire family. Look at the <laughs> height of the doorways. Aren't yeah. they beautiful? And nice bright windows. And off of this dining room, of course, when you walk in the side door from your parking area, then you go here, you've got a back stairs there, you've got an office there that's a little bit out of the way and private. Uh -huh. uh, you've got a nice walk-in for your mud room there where you hang up your coats and your shoes there. And yeah. then the basement, of course, come, goes off that to walk okay. down into the basement. So, But look at the size of this. It's enormous. You could have every holiday here. Well, with anyone you have right. And the lighting and the yeah. ceilings, aren't they just beautiful? Mm -hmm. It's just magnificent. All right, now we'll see the kitchen, which was added on later and is modern, more modern than the other part of the house as it goes. But again, we're talking space here, and just uh, imagine entertaining in this space, eating kitchen with a little dinette set and a built-in banquette there. Mm -hmm. You've got... Um, Counter space here, counter space all around, cabinet space galore. And then off of this, there's a small mud room, what was used as a cake baking uh, room oh. back there. So it's got hookups, and, and it's, uh, but it's nice to access from outside. And, and sure. If you're working out in the back lawn, you can just come in that back door. And then between this room and the family room that we just came through is a sort of a Jack and Jill uh, full bath down here. So that's okay. convenient too. You don't have to go upstairs for the others. So there's three full baths in this house. All right. Do you want to um, try the upstairs now? Sounds Shall good. we go up that master stairway yes, or the back one? All right. Go let's go up, up the, the nice one. All right, Rachel, here we go. We'll take a look at the bedrooms on the second floor. Okay. Look at the width of some of these planks. So beautiful. Yes. Now this is the master bedroom. Oh, look at all the windows. I love the right? little window. And look, you know, it's still it's beautiful architectural details. You've got a closet here and a full bath in here. Oh, that's nice. Very nice. Very nice. Look at the old uh, lighting fixture here. Yeah. Isn't that beautiful? So, wow, I like nice it. Nice big rooms, too. And you know, uh, it has a closet, which a lot of the older houses don't, so that's a big plus, mm -hmm. too. Windows, new windows, too. Yep. So, as I told you earlier, or mentioned it, that uh, there is in-floor heating, so that uh, keeps it warm up here, too. 
And they also have the radiator as a secondary. Okay. Now this bedroom you can access from the side here. This is one of the smaller bedrooms. And then it walks through. There's another bedroom through the closet area there, but you can also get into that in a private area. So it's not like you have to walk through one bedroom to get to the other. So. Okay. But we'll go through this way to take a look. Okay. Now this is another of the bedrooms because we have a total of five bedrooms. Wow. So, and this one shares the uh, closet with the... It's a good sized closet right, though with the right. shelves built right in. Now see, here's the private entrance coming up from the back okay. steps to this bedroom. Okay. Now here we have the landing, big enough for a computer room, a play area, a reading room, like a little mini library right Yeah, here. it is. Pull down attic storage. Good, good light, you know, mm -hmm. nice light, nice windows. Mm -hmm. This is a good place bedroom. Right, now we're at the fourth bedroom here, and uh, this is very nice, has its own closet, and it is a big room, so hardwood floors again. This is your third bathroom, and, <clears throat> excuse me, the laundry room is in here, too. So it's, it's on the second floor. Think how nice that is. Very convenient. You no, know, up and down the stairs with the laundry. I love that long window, too. This is another walk-in closet. Huge. Mm -hmm. Huge, huge. And this is another, this is a, a number, bedroom number five. And you can see the size of this bedroom with a... It's enormous. A large closet area. Hardwood floors, nice windows, nice. It's a nice bright house. You know, it doesn't have any shortage of windows in here. No, and, uh, certainly not. Economical heating. Um, now, the seller currently uses wood, and then he has the oil backup furnace. And he says he only used, like, 50 gallons of oil. And wow. uh, wood was very economical. You know, these outside wood burner yep. that he uses. So. Yeah. And you don't get the smell then, either. No. Okay, Rachel, we've got an incredible five-bedroom, three-bath home, almost 3,200 square feet with 15 acres. Wow. There's a uh, brook that runs across the bottom yep. of the flat down there and outbuildings, a 10,000 square foot plus, uh, you know, second floor on that barn out there. There's a, what used to be an old greenhouse that just needs a little restoration. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's got a lot going for it. It's got quite a bit going for it. Thank you, Candy. Thank you, Rachel.